hey 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 guys how y'all doing today so today i am going to be doing painting over a canvas i didn't like it was an experiment so my colors are the deco art metallics um copper i will be using the deco art metallics rich espresso then i have the folk arts taupe then i have a mixture of the uh, Americana Sea Glass, the Modern Masters Cool Mint, and I mix that with some Artist Loft Iridescent Medium. Yeah, so, um, this is a true, uh, to every sense of the word, a, a true freestyle fluid movement piece. Um, I just <laughs> poured paint on the canvas and just moved it every which way just to see what kind of composition I could get. I've done this before. Um, and I, off, I actually made a, um, it was a coffee Starbucks series that I did. Um, I, I, I've sold most of those. They were small. Um, I believe they were 12 by 12s, if I'm not mistaken. But they were really cute. I framed them. Um, they all look like some type of a coffee mocha Starbucks drink. Um, I did notice that um, <laughs> some of the colors got lost in the sauce. So for some reason, um, and I didn't even use that much, the taupe kind of took over. The taupe and the rich espresso kind of took over. Um, the mint, you cannot see at all. The sea glass, sea green glass, see? I'm trying to say it right, guys. Sea glass. <laughs> it got lost in the sauce. Um, and I think um, with me moving um, as much as I did, um, the copper at some point kind of got lost. But I do think that the colors blended to make... Um, some of the colors that did form in the painting in the end it really just looked like um a mixture of chocolate and um beige hence the name milk chocolate because it kind of reminded me of a um a milk chocolate candy bar with nougat in it so um i didn't realize how much space i needed <laughs> to make this I really needed some space, so I probably should have backed up um, the camera so you could kind of see me moving all around. But I did finally um, be able to get a composition in order for me to kind of, because the canvas I believe is a 24 by 24 or a 20 by 20, I can't remember. <coughs> Excuse me. So I did have, I, I did need some space. So, you know, you'll briefly see me kind of back away from the table to kind of move it around because it was just impossible to keep it in frame um, and try to get this funky swirl twirl type situation going on with the end product. But yeah, um, that's it. I hope you guys enjoy the video. And as I always say, have a blessed day. Have a blessed week. Have a blessed month. Have a blessed year. Oh, by the way, I I now have a clearance section um, on my website. Um, some really great prices. So you guys don't miss out um, to get some original art. Um, you click on the clearance section um, and you can, it's easy checkout. Um, and they do offer split pay. So... Um, I hope you guys get a chance to go on there. If you see something you like, check it out. Um, get it. Um, those purchases help me be able to buy these supplies so that I can keep trying to make these videos. Okay, guys. Talk to you later.